So another thing we're doing here is uh, we're going to be filming a TV show in the next couple of days called Motors TV. And I'll bring out the host of that show here in just a little bit. <laughs> Be on TV again. Excuse me, GoPro. Thank you very much. That guy needs food. What year is that K5 Blazer? 74? It's right on the cusp. What year is it? 60? 59. Nice. Okay. I'm standing next to it. I couldn't see it. El Camino. A lot of El Caminos out lately. 72? 71? Is this a 59? How do you know? Is the title? Wild guess. Good guess. Good guess. Oh, the Holy Christ. I had a crybaby like this. What year is this Chrysler? 55. Is it an automatic or a stick? It's an automatic. It just has a big stick in there. The double. Does it have a push button transmission still? Not no more. I had one with a push button transmission. We called it the crybaby. So where's Chris do? Let me find the host of Motors TV. Where is it? Get him out here. I'll call him. You guys know where he is? Call Chris Dupe. Look at that. That is absolutely beautiful. This is the best seat in the house right here. That's a fifth El Camino. Very popular. I have a 72 El Camino in the store. Station wagon. Oh God. Station wagon. Four years ago. Nice little business. Beautiful. There were years where if you broke up with the station wagon, you laugh it out of your nowadays, you can't even buy it. Beautiful. Paula. The craftsmanship they put into these cars, Unbelievable. Better than they were new. Okay. Sixty-five for two. Tractable? You can see more than you can. Gonna do it for us. It's a mechanical ballet. Oh, it's working. Look at that. I see some concrete back there. You better put it back down. There's some cotton right out of the way. That's beautiful. There he goes. 
Going all the way. Forward, forward. This is what you call a kind of a parachute. If you get to go too fast, it opens that up, slows it down. Oh, the plumber van is here. We gotta leave them on 266. Read the sign. Hold on, it says Cold Beer Testing Station. Volunteers needed. There you go. You got some testers over here. So you guys see a lot of cameras around town because uh, a lot of TV in town. Who saw the pins oil thing commercial they made for the Baron Jackson Cup? Anybody see that? The, the Hellcat, six o'clock in the morning. They close down the streets. They had the pins oil Hellcat, and they they did some big old donuts in the street right here, and they made a video. It's already had thousands of views. Put Reno on the map once again. This is what I had in high school, right here. That is what I had in high school, baby. That brings back more memories. Tim Allen, he had a little bit of an uh, impact on our lives when we were young and we were growing up. Well, I wasn't actually that young, but with his TV show, Home Improvement, we decided, he decided a long time ago to do an automotive improvement show. So check it out online at motors.tv. It's a great show. What do you think about all this night so far, Chris? That's my first time to Reno. This is incredible. Yeah. 
It is, no question about it. So the autocross. There you go. There you go. Shout out to you. Some people take that as an insult. 